Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't talk that. Sam? Yes, Ma. You said that girl you came back with is your wife, right? Yes, we actually got married before we came back, me, in the States. Okay. Is there a problem with that? Yes, you know, you're a prince. I thought you cannot get married without the approval of the gods. Besides, your father will not be happy. By the time you tell him. You're right, Mom, but that's why I would like you to to talk to my father. Try to convince him. Make him understand. Mother! <laughs> Thank you, Mom. Um, we want to take um a walk around the kingdom. We'll be mm. back. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes. Go enjoy yourselves. You are looking so exceptional. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> Thank you, my queen. So, um, we are back. Yes. <laughs> Then we will go where you kill him, Mamu. Greetings. What do we owe to this person? This is our brought. It was not unannounced. I bring a message from the gods. Oh. As the more just said, what's the message? Your Majesty, my prince, I want to speak with you in private. Okay then. Um, my love, please step aside. All right. Just wait for me. Alright, Okay. We're My listening. Head. My prince, what I am about to speak is difficult. Go ahead. The gods demand that you sacrifice your wife, and that has to be done immediately without delay. What? What are you talking about? Do you know what you just said? Somebody should be sacrificed to the gods. Is it more? What are you saying? I should sacrifice my precious wife, the future queen of this kingdom. I should sacrifice her to the gods. Maybe you didn't hear them well. 
I suggest you go back to your shrine and reconsult. Da! Maybe, maybe there's a mother could be a mix up somewhere. Da! Da! How dare you utter such words? I am the messenger and custodian of the gods. I don't. Anyway, you had me well. Well, I don't care if you are a messenger or a custodian. Well, hear this. My wife will not and cannot be sacrificed to the gods. What I'm saying is that. There could be a mix up somewhere. Is it not better, like you rightly said? You go to consult. There might be a better message. Your Majesty, there is no need for that. The gods don't make mistakes. As you can see, and as you have heard, the gods have made their requests. Remember, the gods do not have patience. I take my leave. I take my leave. Hi. Hi. Oh, that is nonsense. I ran nonsense. My love. Oh. Um, my love. What's going on? You both look weak. Is there something I should know? Um, it's it's nothing you should be worried about. No, no. Okay. All right. We have to tell her. Mom. It concerns her. Mom. It's her. The whole thing is about. What concerns me, my uh, friend? Uh, Jason Moore just said that Ajani demands that you be sacrificed to the gods. May the gods forbid. You see? Me? Yes. Sacrificed? You. For what? I mean, what, what, what are you saying? Okay, that's why I said you shouldn't worry yourself, okay? Because as far as I'm concerned, he's talking nonsense. Adam! Adam is only telling you, baby. 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 Adam is only telling you, Kirikiri kana buku ese. Mamu mbieli mamu. Hey! Ajane! Ajane! She and Maka must be sacrificed. Where yes? She and Maka must be sacrificed. Please tell me from now. Obulo ni kwa re kwa taloki. Obulo ni kwa tale kwa taloki. Ajane! He has to, I think there's a mix up somewhere. Yes. Hey. Alpha. What is he looking at? Are you alright? Are you alright? Babe? Alpha. Mom, why is he at Please somewhere? talk to us. Boo? Asuka, boo. Where is he going to? Alpha, honey. Evan, where are you going? Where are you going? Honey, where are you going? I think that man has hypnotized my husband. What's going on? Honey? Just, just my queen, you need to go get him back. Let him be. Let him be? Yes. Are we going to kill him? My husband? Mom, you need to... Yes. Honey? Oh Stop. my God, this whole thing... Why did this Daddy. man come here in the first place, my queen? I don't want anything to happen to my husband. My queen, please. I don't want anything to happen to my husband. I don't want anything to happen to my husband. My husband, I don't want anything to happen to my husband. I don't want anything to happen to my husband. I don't want anything to happen to my husband. I don't want anything to happen to my husband. <laughs> uh, why is there more? 
I am ready to sacrifice my wife to the gods. Welcome, my prince. <laughs> I have always known that you are the real son of the sun. On Nagel Morgan. <laughs> I am pleased with your decision to obey the orders of the gods. Welcome. When do we proceed? Well spoken, my prince. We will proceed immediately. Go and get her ready. I don't know when you get a killing mongo. I don't know when you get a killing mongo. I don't know when you get a killing mongo. I don't know when you get a killing mongo. I don't know when Prince, it's time. Take it. Yes. What am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> the gods have instructed that you will be the one to kill her. So go ahead and do it. Go ahead and behead her. Go ahead and do it. I know you can. Bupi Isi! All of this. Why? When I thought it's getting better, it's not. No progress at all. I'm tired. I just want to see my husband strong and better. What is going on? Mother, you're there. What happened? What is wrong with you? You're not looking okay. Why are you pacing around? Mom, please talk to me. What is it? It's about your father. What about him? What happened to him? I'm just coming from his chamber. It's not, it's not good. He's not getting any better. He's getting worse by the day. Just calm down, mother. Just calm down. But the doctor was here a few days ago. He didn't say anything regarding that. So I don't know what you're talking about. I'm as confused as you. I don't even know what to do again. I just want your father to be on his feet, going about his business, not lying there like a lock of wood and not doing anything for himself. That is no good at all for a man like him. I know. Can you just calm down before your BP will rise? It's breaking me down. It's just getting on me. Mommy, please, at least be strong for us. You don't need to do this. Can we just go to his room? I want to see him. Please. Okay. Father, why are you like this? Why are you doing this to us? Mother, have you called the doctor? Not yet, but I've, I've sent for no. That's okay. We need to call the doctor right now. Oh, okay, you call the doctor while I call your brother. Okay, no problem. I will do just that. Father, please. You need to be strong for us. You can't die on us. Please.
Oh no, sir. Yes, I did. I hope all is well. There, there, there is. What is what is wrong? Why this ambulance out there? Oh no. The king is in a critical condition. My goodness. As we speak, he cannot move any part of his body. He is unconscious right now. So I quickly called the doctor and explained everything to him. He was the person that came with the ambulance to take the king to the hospital. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh, please, let's go in and see him. Yes, okay. This way, please. Well, for now, I can't really say what the problem is. That's the reason we need to take him to the hospital so we can carry out proper examination as well, run some tests on him. Doctor, what are you saying? Do you mean you don't know what is wrong with him? Oh, no. As you can see, the king is in a coma. And that's more reason we need to take him to the hospital since the equipment required cannot be brought here. So, Doctor, what is the next step? Going forward, what is the next thing for us to do? Uh, Your Majesty, we need to take him to the hospital immediately. Let's do that immediately. This talk time is ticking fast. Uh, um, no, listen. Uh, listen, Doctor. Whatever thing you know you can do to make sure that His Majesty is reversed, just do it. Oh no, I promise you, I will do my best. But remember, we only treat while God does the healing. Just do that your let's best. Go, do go, it. Go, go, go. I promise you, nothing will happen to him. Okay? We believe so. Let's go, let's go, please. Okay, let me. Let's go. Have you called the prince to tell him of the situation on ground? Yes, I called him before you came in. Oh, that's good. Did you tell him everything about the way it is? No, I, I didn't tell him. Even though he insisted on knowing why the urgent demand for his return, I didn't want to tell him because I don't want him to panic. Uh, but why? Do you think whatever you told him will make him to come because at this point we need him around? Yes, I trust my son. I, he will come back. We need him around in case. In case of what? I'd better not complete that statement because nothing bad will happen to my husband. Why are you talking like that? Oh, yeah, yeah, one No, our king will not die. We pray that he will, nothing will happen to him. Is but he? you know, we do think whatever you, whatever it is that you told him will propel him to come. That just the. Well, like I told you earlier, I trust my son. He listens to me. He will come back as quickly as possible. Hence his head. Come home. Here we come. Uh, there's no problem, Your Majesty. And um, please, just keep me informed. Anytime he arrived, just make sure you pass the information to me so that I will pass the information to the cabinets and all of us will gather here. Of course, you know my son will need such a welcome. I will let you know. I will do that. And I will inform you on time. Thank you. You're welcome. Please, always take good care of the king. He's my husband. I will always take care of him. Not only your husband, he is our king. First, my husband. <laughs> let me quickly dress and go to the hospital. Yes, Sarah, let me do my way. I will guess your father. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I've seen that they've taken father to the hospital already. Yes. So have you called my brother? Yes, I have spoken to him. He said he will be here as quickly as possible. That's good news. Um, let me rush to the hospital now and say, Father. I'll come with you. Let me change into something different. But I still can't. We can go like this. Yes, Mother. You're looking beautiful like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rebecca, my prince, you tell me about that kingdom. Uh, I mean, what has changed? <laughs> My prince, a lot has changed. You won't believe it. Wow. So there are innovations, right? Of course. You see, your your father, his majesty, 
brought in some investors. Okay. Wow. So those investors established a very big company. Oh yeah, I'm and aware of that. Good. And that company have helped a whole lot of un unemployed youth. I'm aware. He told me. Based minimizing the rate of uh, crime in our community. <laughs> That's good. That's good. That's good. Babe, are you seeing anything? What, what, what do you think? I like what you're seeing, right? Yes, like the village has changed a whole lot. Honestly. Credit to His Majesty. He's yeah. doing a nice work. I'm impressed. Whoa! <laughs> I can actually believe this is my village. You see, can, uh, can I surprise the both of you, my friends? Okay. Yeah. You see, we now have pipe wall waters, electricity, and a whole lot of development. Are you serious? You people, mean like steady electricity? Believe me, people now build classy houses. Uh, I can see. Look at the house. <laughs> Whoa! You know, Man. you know what, my friends? Just chill. Once we get to the palace, I'll take you around the village. Oh man, I can't wait. Honestly, I can't wait. I cannot wait. Sincerely, I cannot wait. Believe me, your father is indeed a noble king. Yeah, he has done a lot. A lot of things. He has changed so many things here. Yeah. Believe me. I'm impressed. I believe. In your time, you'll do better. Of course. <laughs> of course. I'll do bigger, bro. I'll do bigger. Don't worry, when we go. Who has the house? Who has the house? It's um, Chibuzo. Chibuzo. The guy who manages the company that was established. The company I spoke of. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, he's managing the Sure, company. so he think... He's doing well with his salaries. <laughs> I can see that. To be home. Yes. I like what I'm saying, man. Oh, hi, 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 everyone. Hi. Well, mom. Let's go inside. The father is waiting. Oh. Yes. Honestly, mom, you're looking. You're looking. You're looking. What's going on here? Why is he lying so lifeless? Can someone tell me what's, what's, what's happening here? Well, Your Highness, the king is very, very sick. In fact, he is in a critical condition. So why is he not in the hospital? We must take him to the hospital immediately. Please. Uh, and Your Highness, that will not be necessary for now. Look, according to our tradition, the king cannot spend the night in the hospital, no matter the circumstances. What nonsense are you talking about? What are you saying? So he should be left here to die? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Something has to be done. I won't let this happen. I must take my father to the hospital, please. Your Highness, he was taken to hospital yesterday when he collapsed. After the doctor examined him, he ran some tests on him. He was brought back in the evening. So right now we're waiting for the lab results. So once we see the lab results, then we know what to do. Exactly. Honestly, this is frustrating, okay? 
I won't let this happen. Something has to be done as soon as possible. I won't let my father die here. Please, excuse me. Sam, you're welcome. Thank you, Dad. I am happy you have met me still breathing. Mm -hmm. I am. I am happy too. But, Dad, I really do not want you to sound negative about your health. Okay, your son is here. Your precious son, Afomi, flees back, and I'm going to do everything within my task to resuscitate your health, okay? Hmm, thank you. Thank you, son. You're welcome, Dad. Thank you, thank you. <sighs> I am overjoyed and I'm happy that you are sitting close to me and I'm still speaking, breathing. Whether or not I I live. It's left for the gods. I know. And our ancestors. I know that. Mm. I know. But I still want you to know that nothing is going to happen to you. Okay? Yes. Um. <coughs> Welcome. Thank you, Dad. I was told you returned with a girl. Oh, <clears throat> yeah. But I, I'm gonna tell you about her soon. Oh. I mean, later. Oh. Right now, I want to go take a quick shower. All right. Seated here waiting for you, but I can see you had a long talk with your father. You two had a had to have discussion. Oh, not really. I left for us from a while ago. Oh, really? Yeah. I can see you're dressed differently. You're heading out, right? Oh yes. I actually want to visit a few places with my friend. Oh, just that I wanted us to have a, a long talk as well. But since you're going, no problem. I'll keep it. When you come back, we'll talk about it. Okay, if you can wait, fine. Shall we wait? Very well. You be careful. I will. <laughs> careful. Be good, Mom. I will. I'm good. And you too. Right. Bye, see you. Mom, you said you wanted to talk to me. 
Yes, it's about that pretty girl you came home with. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Of course it is. She's my fiance. And we're planning to get married. As a matter of fact, that's one of the reasons I came back. What? What? No, you never bought that to tell us all these years. You never told us you met a girl, where she came from, who she is, and all that. You kept it all by yourself, only to surprise us like this. Yes, I wanted it a surprise, no? Okay. You look worried. What is it? There's no problem, just that I'm wondering how well you know the girl, her background, her parents, her mother, and all that. No, I mean, you got nothing to worry about. I know her well enough, okay? Like I said before, she's from a neighboring village. Yes, she's, she's cool. Is that all you wanted to talk to me about? Yes. Nothing more? No. Okay then, I'll be in my room. All right. <laughs> Mom, don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Don't worry yourself. Mom, got nothing to worry about. Got nothing to worry about. Okay. So, son, when are you getting married? Very soon. Very, very soon. As a matter of fact, I came back from the States with someone. Someone? Yeah, Mom. Of course you've met her. Hmm. This girl you people are talking about. I hope, one, she's not white. That she's an evil girl. And possibly from within, yeah. Yes, Father. She's from within. Oh. All right. I rest my case. So, when are you bringing her to the family? Tomorrow. I'll bring her tomorrow for proper introduction. Mom and Princess, you already met her. Yes, Father. She's an angel and she looks so pretty. Yeah. <laughs> 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 mm -hmm. Character first. <laughs> but I'm happy you like her. Uh, and since you like her, there should be food prepared to await her coming. Yes, right? of course. Yeah. <laughs> Mom, you look worried. You okay? No, I'm fine. Oh, let's keep talking. You're, you're saying something. You should be happy for me, aren't you? <laughs> well, Dad, tomorrow. <laughs> hey, babe. I'm fine. How are you? Yeah, very well. Uh, well, I'm here. I'm home. Resting. What about you? The movie. What's the title? I see. Seeing you tomorrow. Call you back, okay? All right, honey. That's fine. Son? Hey, Mom. How are you? <clears throat> I'm fine. You should have said something. I needed to come here because I wanted us to talk in private. Okay. I. I hope there's no problem because I noticed your countenance when I I said I brought home a lady. That is the reason I'm here. Remember when you were in the States? I told you there was this particular girl. I was grooming for you. And you never told me you were coming with a lady to impose her on us. 
I'm not again, please. Okay? We've talked about this countless times, and I vehemently said no. Why are you bringing it up again? I am bringing it up because I am your mother. And you are my son. Oh. I want the very best for you. This girl in question is a good girl. From a responsible home. She's even a graduate from a reputable university. Oh. Mom, listen, I, I appreciate your love for me. I appreciate the fact that you want the best for me, but not in this case. This is 21st century. People don't find wise for others. Okay? I found someone my heart beats for. Believe me, you're gonna love her when you see her. I'm serious. Just that, just that I, I put in so much to groom this girl. Now I want the whole thing to be in fertility. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Mom. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry about that, but you're gonna love her. Believe me. You like her. She's from a responsible home, a responsible family. She's a first class product. And this girl is the best. No problem. I'll try and see her tomorrow. Oh. See, I... <clears throat> Thank you, Mom. Thank you. Honestly, this means a lot to me. Yes. Thank Excuse you. me. I I'll see you around. TV. Home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't touch that.